But now I want to assimilate one more abyss into this model, a, a le one less familiar to us as rationalists, but so well familiar to us just one cars, level deeper cars, in the psyche uh, in the as the Christians was, and Westerners. Right, now here's that the is this idea of the world will end. There will be a final time, but there is not only the crisis of the death of the individual, there is the crisis of the death of the individual. There is the crisis of the death of the individual. a small island in the Pacific, the U.S. government... What this seems to be about is that the time that there is an awareness of existence of the soul is about 50,000 BP until the resolution of the apocalyptic potential. There's something the like 50,000 years, which in biological time is only a multitude of years. The entire story of the bomb is a thousand times more powerful than the bomb that hit Hiroshima. In that period, everything hangs in balance because it is a mad rush from monkeydom to starship. And in the lead, across those 25,000 years, energies are released, religions are shot off like sparks. Philosophies evolve and die, science arises, magic is what happens all of these things with control of power, with greater and less degrees, and then the constancy of here. There is the possibility, as in the metaphor of dying, there is the possibility of mucking it up, of aborting the species transformation or hyperspatial intellect. We are now. There can be no doubt that we are now in the final seconds well, of that crisis, a crisis which involves former colleagues, the colleagues, end of history, to be here. the departure from the planet, in all the triumph to over death, and, and the release of, of the individual and from matter. Past and present that have done so much for our country and our freedom, so if we could maybe just give them a round again. Thank you.